Hello, my friends. I was looking for watermelons because you know what? I need watermelons in my life. But you know what else is happening? The sun is going down. And it's going down quickly. And I'm out in the middle of nowhere. So I better get home. I better get back to that big, beautiful temple. Oh, goodbye, son. Sun is going down. Stay with me longer, son. Okay, so all of these trees are just to the east of my temple. And so I've got to get back. So we're heading west. And um, should be right over this hill. We should be able to see our big, beautiful temple. Okay, okay, nothing spawned. Let's go. There we go. Look how beautiful that looks with the sunset. Oh, that's beautiful. But we got to get home. We got to get to it. All right, so we dive in. Let's go. Let's swim. We're swimming home. We're swimming home. Ooh, nice sunset water. Looks good. Um, oh, yeah, I have a respiration head. Uh, I have a golden helmet with respiration. So look at how well we can go underwater here. I feel nice and safe underwater. Okay, but it's getting very dark. Uh oh, that means the sun is gone, gone. All right, let's go. Nothing spawning, nothing spawning. Let's go. All right, look at this big, beautiful temple at night. Oh, it's so nice. All right, let's go. Let's go jump and waddle and open the door real fast and... Oh, I'm terrible at that. Okay, all right. Phew. And go to bed. Hiya, everybody. It's Sensei Matt, and welcome back. This is Percival, and we are playing on the hardest level, hardcore mode. Hey, that means we have one life to live. Today, we're going to be building on the north side of our temple. We're going to be doing our special project. And so we are going to be transforming this beautiful swamp into something fantastic. So our plans are being made, but I need a lot of quartz. So let's go. Here we are, my friends. Oh, look at how creepy this place is. You bust a block and suddenly you get some lava. So we're just going to drain this out. Show the lava who's boss. You can't get me. And we are tunneling straight ahead because I'm trying to get out of a crimson forest biome because there's, I, I think there's a lot more quartz available in some of the other biomes. So I'm just trying to make a tunnel that goes just straight to a new biome and trying to find more quartz there because I did the calculations. You can see, yeah, see there's our crimson forest. I did the calculation that our new project is going to be 32 by 32 which means we're going to need over a thousand quartz slabs just for the floor um so it's not gonna be good we're gonna need a lot so here i am and we're just picking up quartz as we go along <gasps> that's not good ouch 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 ouch, ouch. <laughs> run away run away how come i can't go faster oh i gotta go faster i gotta uh oh uh oh uh oh um yo go out stop being on fire okay okay uh, eat, eat, eat. Whoa, 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 that, um, that was very close to the end, the end of everything. After that near-death experience, I took a break from the nether and started laying out our new project, and that's a 30 by 30 right there. There's going to be one more ring, which is going to be smooth quartz around the edge there to make it 32 by 32. So as I was digging through the very dangerous nether, I had a genius idea and I said to myself, Self, why don't you just build another net nether portal and then just maybe you'll be in a different biome. So it's time to pick up some obsidian and put our theory to the test. So let's go. Now that I had the obsidian, I jumped on Pig, my trusty horse, and rode all the way down to where my trading village is. And so I'm going to build the nether portal here because I have a nice road right to it. And I'm hoping it's far enough away that we end up in a different biome. So now that this is done, we'll use our flint and steel, bring that portal to life, and I'm going to make a little step to get in. And let's hope that we are in a different biome than the Crimson Forest. Um, okay, we're in the Warped Forest. And, um, I think I know where this is, actually. Um, that tunnel that I was building straight across, I think is up there. Um, I think that if I go this way and I look up, I should be able to find it. Um, but this isn't very helpful, because as you can see, 
there's not a lot of quartz around here. Anyway, let's keep our quartz hunt going. My friends, I returned to our original portal and I just kept going straight in that one long tunnel and look at what we found, another biome. This is a nether waste. And now look at all this quartz just waiting for us to gobble up. And as you can see, it's fairly peaceful for the nether and we are in luck. Look at all this quartz. In this new biome, I looked over here and noticed a fossil and look at this, it's a soul sand valley. So there's all kinds of soul sand here. Not only that, but there's also soul soil. And we'll gather some of that up because elevators are coming to our build. Finding that new biome was a genius move. Look at all this quartz. It's just lying around, ready to be picked up. I'm just following one vein to the next vein. It's all pretty reachable stuff. I'm not having to build towers up. And I just look over here, here's another vein. We go over there's another vein over there so we just keep digging them up i have so many stacks right now i think we might even have enough to finish off our ground floor of our new project which is awesome it just is collecting collecting look i have 37 levels i think i started this with like something like 27 levels and um yeah hopefully maybe i can even get that infinity bow that i've been working on and i'm just going from one vein to the next vein and everything is very good. I'm getting ready to head back, actually, because as you can see, we're coming to this warped forest, and um, that's kind of heading back to where we were. And so I gotta find my road again and head back out and see just how far we are. Okay. Oh, did did he just see me? Um. Oh, I hope not. I hope not. Um, <gasps> he did. Ouch! 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 Run away! Run away! Run away! Run away! Run away! Oh, jeez, he's faster than me. Um, all right, we gotta fight. We gotta fight. Um, 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 um. Run away and fight. Just like, like creeper. <gasps> I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I can't go anywhere. <gasps> uh, guys, guys. Um. Oh no. Oh no. Percival, you didn't. You didn't survive. Oh no. We're in the Nether. This is not good. Oh, my plans, my plans are all done. Oh no, Percival's all gone. Poltroon, who became Percival. Oh no, what a terrible end. Got caught by looking at a netherman, or an enderman rather. Oh, what a terrible way to die. Oh, what are we gonna do next? Maybe we'll start a new one. Hmm, I gotta give some time to think about that. Oh no. Well, we gotta look on the bright side too. Uh, now, that, now that I've lost, I can go ahead and take this nice big view up here. Take a look at what we've built. Uh, all the roads, all the landscaping, all the hours. Uh, it was labor of love, I think, and I really enjoyed playing this playthrough. And um, I think I may end up doing another one at some point. See how my road goes way back over there. Um, you can see that it was a lot of fun building this, but I learned a lot from doing this playthrough. I learned a lot about editing, I learned a lot about playing the game, and um, I think that if I had it all to do over again, I'd do a lot of things differently, and um, that might just happen. So I might take a break for a couple weeks and figure out what I want to do, but um, I really appreciate everybody watching along as we were building our awesome projects. Looks really cool from the sky, I have to be honest. Um, what a fun build that was. So, um, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time.